In this presentation, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to upload your finished assignment files into Canvas. I am beginning at the My Loyalist Portal page, which is on the Loyalist College website. And I'm going to go down and look for the Canvas button. And it'll be in here somewhere. Yours may not be over here like mine, but it will be in here somewhere. And I'm going to click on that button now, which takes me to the Canvas dashboard page. So here you will see a list of all your courses, and of course it won't look exactly like mine here, but you will see one called Computer Essentials, and that's the one we'll click on for my particular assignments. So let's click on that now. And once we get here, I'm just going to actually switch to Student View, so it'll look more like what you should see. And if we look down this column right here, more towards the left here, there is a link for Assignments. And I'm just going to ask you to click on Assignments, and that will bring you to the list of all of your assignments. I'm just going to use the first one here as an example and you would click on the assignment title to get to that specific assignment. And once you arrive at the assignment page you're going to see some of these icons here. You'll see one called Upload. If it's not already selected, just select it. And then you scroll down a little bit till you see this icon here. And this is where you will go and retrieve the file to submit to Canvas. So my files are on the OneDrive, so I'm going to use my example file that I have on my OneDrive. So I'm going to click on this icon here. And it may take a second or two, but it's going to pop up a search window. And I can see the link to my OneDrive right here. And all of my courses are inside Spring Semester 2024, so I'll double click that. And it is inside of Computer Essentials that I have the file that I wish to upload. So I'm going to double click that folder icon as well. And finally, I'm at the file that I wish to upload. It's just a test file that I'm using here right now. And we select it. And then we click Open. And you'll see a progress bar and then finally a green check mark. And that means that you successfully uploaded the file. And the name of the file should be over here. Okay. If for some reason you change your mind and you want to choose a different file, at this stage, you could delete it and just click on here again and repeat the process. But I've uploaded the file, so let me just scroll down here and just show you the last step. Very importantly, is to click Submit Assignment. Once that's done, you'll get a feedback that it's submitted. And in time, it, if it's the right kind of document, you will see a preview of it. As a Word document, it can be previewed in Canvas. Other types, file types may not, but Word certainly can. Now, a nice little bonus, too, is that once you have uploaded your file, let's say you wanted to retrieve it, you can download it again through this download button right here. Now, it will download a PDF of this Word file. Other file types, they will remain as their own, but this will be translated as a PDF, which can anyway be open in Microsoft Word. Okay, so if you did want to retrieve it, you could click the download button here. But the file is all submitted, good to go, and ready for the teacher to assign marks to it. So again, if you wanted to, let's say you changed your mind an hour later and you wanted to submit a different file, there is a new attempt button right here, and that will just be submitted as well, and it will show up as the latest file from the teacher's uh, vantage point. Okay, so once again, just a quick review from the home page inside of the course, you would click on Assignments. You would see your listed assignments. And if I go to this sec second one here, it will take you to that assignment page. And just scroll down till you see the Upload button and the little rocket. You click on the little rocket. It's going to pop open a search window. And again, it may take a couple of seconds. And go and retrieve the file that you wish. I'm going to click Cancel here. But that, again, is how you can submit your files online into Canvas.